<laughs> Hello, people. My name is Kale Boss. Hmm? The only boss. <laughs> oh, wait, what is? Ah, have you heard? Wait, do you know that Tap Tap Send is live in Texas? Oh, you didn't know. We went to New York. Now we are live in Texas. So, people in Texas and around, all you have to do is to download Tap Tap Send. Yes, Tap Tap Send has become the most unique, secure, and fast way of sending money across the world to your loved ones anywhere okay so download tap tap sign on google play store or app store and when you're in texas or around you just have to put in the code txgh what did i say txgh and you get ten dollars for your first transaction you make <laughs> texas very soon we'll conquer everywhere <laughs> Download Top Top Send now on Google Play and App Store. Top Top Send. It's secure, convenient, easy, and fast. <laughs> Everybody check now. Check it. Fat check it. Fat check it. Check it. The beat is real. Don't we make it kill ya. Get your green cell glucometer and check it. Sugar level, checky, 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 Let's do entertainment. Let's talk entertainment. Sammy Flex TV, we are indeed entertainment. We are here to serve you right. Good, positive, perfect. And what else again? Anything entertainment, that is what we've taken upon ourselves to feed you with. Sit and then relax and enjoy today's episode. My name is MC Berima. I happen to be your favorite MC's MC. And in the shows with me, my favorite brother's blogger. Follow me on all the social media platforms. I go by the name Kobichos Van, K O B B Y J O S V A, and yes, Instagram, sir. Facebook, Twitter. Yeah, yeah. All right, so right, that is right, right. Kobichos Van for you. I like the way he says it, and uh, he's doing very well in the space. Um, or most most of the events in Nigeria, he's been, you know, feeding us on what's going on when we are not there. He's doing the positive work as far as entertainment is concerned. Rulan Amati happens to be a social media marketer to shark z and uh, same way a broadcaster um, event organizer and uh, blogger and a reporter yeah, thank you. and now he's me and uh, i have to name here no, 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 i'm not yet found some question i'm sure that's why this teacher what what is it well it's um some kind of fashion people, thing people people wear watches some mm. people wear bracelets this is mine that's that's how I can explain it for okay. people. To, there's no need for further explanation. Oh, but it's good. It's, it looks nice. You know, Thank sometimes you. you know, it's just that a man will sample some a comfort. Oh well, chief chief priest chief mm. priest is in in our local communities. Being a chief priest is one of the higher offices in our local mm. community. So mm. if if somebody calls you a chief priest, it is you that you are the more or less the eye of the gods. So. Mm. It's it's an honor. Okay, so now he is the eye of the gods. He's accepted to it, and uh, far end we have our professor, our master, <laughs> specialist in IT, <laughs> YouTuber, um, Ken Chamo, Solomon Intimbulu, Solomon Solomon Intimbulu, bra. Yeah, Boko. Was I a fan? I had those. I brought some. Yeah, me, me, I'm crying. 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 Me, I'
Yes, I have it. I brought so bad. Oh no! Sometimes, yes, sometimes <clears throat> it's good so that you know, say people are expecting so much from you, yeah. so you have to learn. Yeah. So it keeps you on your toes to even do more. So I appreciate I, I'll, that. I'll take it. Yeah. I appreciate for that. Sure. For Professor, sure, Professor, I appreciate that. <laughs> Professor Chemo, and yeah, Professor, I'm gonna rebel on one of Professor Chemo is now in Akakakra. We are monitoring one or two things and systems now. You do on every panel, every man a doctor now. Yeah, man. Already, currency the digital raster, he happens to be the one in charge of the cameras, and he is now a doctor. Doctor currency, doctor in camera works, doctor philosopher in camera works. Oh no, and they handle cameras now. And to Richie Flex, our director and our producer, oh no, or your nurse. Ness, 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 Ness Richie. And it was your be able to 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 yeah, yeah, sister, I'm going to be a warrior. Okay, you're a good one. I mean, you're a good one. Oh, that's fine. Other, other things now, trending in your social media, EPMB. That's fine. That's fine. Roland, mm. the comes of SM, how, mm. how is it going? Shagzi, I mean, I'm mm. mm. yes. not sure. Any And so far, it has been good, but it can <coughs> still be better. There's still more room for improvement. So, as, as an organization, mm -hmm. we are still learning, we are still pushing through, we are still mm -hmm. cracking our brains to bring new things. Because mm -hmm. we serve the people, we can't stop now. Because day in, day out, the people are also expecting more things, mm -hmm. different things, improvement of what we did last mm -hmm. year. Yes, indirect, th like directly, we may not be in competition with somebody, mm -hmm. but indirectly, we are in competition with ourselves or even with the system. So. Mm -hmm. As much as we would want to maybe please the people, we are also looking at also beating our personal goals mm -hmm. and improving on ourselves. So, so far, so good. Okay, nice one. This is what I want to hear. And to you being with us, I mean, watching us now, um, how is your um, your system? Sorry. And uh, thank you very much for being a part of Summer Flex TV family. And if this happens to be the first time, I you being a Wudasa, please do well to subscribe and make sure you uh, share the link to loved ones, family and friends, so that they also enjoy what's going on in the country and of course outside. Let's officially welcome you and let's welcome my brothers as well. We are going to um, sit and then discuss a lot today and uh, we would want to start with Kwame Dazi. I call him my uncle in the entertainment industry because you know when it comes to pushing out or pushing me be he's been supportive always advising and you know telling us how to do it and what to do it um he made a post where in you know say we are all experiencing shatawale his new you know track featuring techno that is incoming on the connect album and put the lyrics of the song the supposed, I'm asking some supposed English scholars be, are saying, say, mm, where's be a shot at AUC, you know? Uh, and tell you, and tell us, I think, say, there's a problem somewhere. We want to really enter into it. We want to really enter into it and see if truly, truly, he good. Is it necessary? A uh, song? It, you know, is it, you know, something that we should be thinking about or we should be, you know, Cared, I mean, we should, we should care about. This is what Kwame Dazi posted on Facebook. And I read it. I should in case, with some, you know, question mark and some laughing emoji. While Shatawale's new release song, Incoming, is enjoying high patronage across various platforms, some have raised the issue of a possible grammatical error in one of his, of, of his lines. He sings, should in case, in a part of the song. According to English scholars, the expression is wrong. You either say should or in case. But what happened to the artistic license which gives creative the power to alter the norm for the special effect? The Shatawale goof with should in case or he was using poetic lines. Anna, 
you people say you know be grammar we go chop this is what kwami dazi um is concerned about okuhu somewhere and then he you know felt like sharing with all of us and i want us to bring it on board here and truly truly we've listened to the song and you 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 could hear him say should in case so now i'm starting free chabo so now grammatically it is wrong Mm -hmm. Now, in the song, is it necessary that you have to, you know, be accurate on the words? I mean, you choose your words right. And as I say, far, nah, far. Yeah, and I think that uh, all more you know, all more be linguistic uh, teachers or mm -hmm. professors or lecturers mm -hmm. or whatever. Mm -hmm. No, we, there's there's no need to even consider that. Mm -hmm. Even if you consider that you are you are not an artist. Mm -hmm. If you are an artist, you say things that will make people feel good. You mm -hmm. say things that will make people connect mm -hmm. to whatever that you are doing. So, mm -hmm. trying to be uh, linguistically right mm -hmm. will not make you even be a good act mm -hmm. artist. You will not be a good artist if mm -hmm. you think about those things. I think Kwame Dazi answered the question. Mm -hmm. So, I don't know why he even put that thing out and 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 um I'm, I'm doubting where it is coming from because i have not seen it okay. well maybe some people are talking about it but we don't have to give uh, something like this uh, the room uh, uh, the room or even a day to even talk about it mm. because if you appreciate uh, uh, art mm. artworks then there's no argument here I see. Art is about making people feel good. Mm -hmm. Art is about uh, entertaining people. Art is about how people appreciate whatever is around them, their environment and all that. Mm -hmm. I can bet you, even if we, we, we come to our local uh, language songs, we will get a lot of them. Mm -hmm. A lot of people doing their own thing that we, we don't even think about it. Mm -hmm. And sometimes they even say certain things that you don't understand like lumba will say something that you have to go so deep mm -hmm. to get the meaning of what he was trying to say yeah. but you still enjoy the song mm -hmm. so so at, 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 at this point what is your business mm -hmm. trying to correct somebody's grammar in an artistic work mm -hmm. like music not necessary in fact it's a non-starter me mm -hmm. for me you don't even have to think about it. I see. So for you to even go there, it's, it's wrong in the first place. And mm -hmm. besides, he has that poetic license to do that. Mm -hmm. So even if, uh, yes, it's a grammatical error, mm -hmm. but it fits in the song. Mm -hmm. If you are saying that, okay, the way he said it, the song is not nice because of that, then you have no a case. Okay. In, uh, in that aspect, you are criticizing the artistic mm -hmm. aspect of it but if it's nice but we don't say it like that the uh, it doesn't belong to art it, it belongs to linguistics class so mm -hmm. those who are into it i mean well good for them you can people learn uh, 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 languages mm -hmm. and then they use it in their daily life in mm -hmm. fact that's their business mm -hmm. their business is to write good english or speak good english or speak good language in yeah. general yeah as their business or mm -hmm. as their job for them i i think yes they will have every right to say whatever but mm -hmm. if they are if those people are appreciating artistic work i think that will fall short because in artistic work we, we don't bring such things in there okay all right thank you but then let me ask you this final question you know there are most of the time let's say top celebrities like you know the Jay Z's, let's say the those who use the English language mm -hmm. proper proper in doing their songs mm -hmm. would they consider such lines or you know they mess lines? up all the time in fact them, yeah? yeah we have a bonnet like the, the, there's a certain language that you only get it from the blacks in America mm -hmm. in their songs they say certain things that a normal English speaking person may not even know what you are trying to say okay so what do you mean it's yeah. it's a they say you it's it's it, it, more like um uh language uh street 
vibe or vibe. street language or whatever that you may call it. We even have some in Ghana here. There are certain things that mm. you, you can say it in English that English speaking people will not understand mm. unless you explain that. Oh, when we say that this is what we mean. I, I, I watched one video, uh, a local guy, like a Ghanaian guy speaking to a foreigner, English, mm -hmm. and then he said, oh, you dear, you don't sleep finish. Mm -hmm. You don't sleep finish. Mm -hmm. Do you understand that? No. You don't know what the guy was trying to say. You don't fin S sleep finish. You don't sleep finish. Uh -huh. What do you mean? Like, open that. Okay. You okay. don't sleep okay. finish. Okay. There's a own then it's like you want more. us to give you more time to sleep. You'll mm. be sleeping all the time. Okay. But the, he said it to uh, uh, an English-speaking person. You don't sleep finish. <laughs> but, but translating it. <laughs> <laughs> now you, you, now you get, get it. You I'm get going it. to come. Okay, okay. So any, like, most Ghanaians will understand what the person yeah. is trying to say. Yeah. But English speaking person will not get it. Meanwhile, we say that we are speaking English. Mm -hmm. So, hey, no, what? what? Yes, exactly. What? In fact, when you watch the video, that's that was the reaction. So, yes, people, some people will understand you based on yeah. where they are coming from and how you want to give the message to them. And the same way, I think a lot of people will get uh, Shatawali because mm -hmm. uh, should in case so is one of the. Uh, lines that we've been saying many many times mm -hmm. you can't do that in a formal setting you can't use that language mm. if you are a scholar or if you are diploma okay. a, a diplomat trying to mm. write to somebody like mm. you can't do that but you have every right to do that in a song or in an artistic piece okay because people will understand the art work mm. not your language in there it, it, it's all about the art so I think it's, it's all over the place. Wherever we go, you get people messing up some language just to say the things in the way that they think their people will get it or can connect to it. So I don't see this as a big deal. Okay. Chemo doesn't see it as a big deal. That is him. And let's listen to Kobe Josman, what he also has to share with us. Bra. Yeah, bro. Mm. What, 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 what do you have to say about it? Is, I think, is, is I the think language English the barrier? No, it shouldn't be the case. Mm. And if that is what we consider, then I think we all have to be scholars, just as Jemu said mm -hmm. before, I mean, putting a, a piece out there. And more or less to what Kwame does this issue, I think he's trying to place himself into the issue, trying to play a, a neutral ground. Yeah. Not necessarily trying to ridicule Shatawali, mm -hmm. but he's more or less trying to, I mean, I speak mean, for the The, the lay person, okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. So I'm not too surprised about it. At the position that he stands, mm -hmm. being a journalist, being a media person, I think um, with those um, rules, and anytime they want to, I mean, speak for the ordinary people, the mm -hmm. fan, the fan base, who always use some, um, I mean, reasons to try to ridicule some of these yeah. artists. You know? But let's also consider or go um, to this angle. Like we always appreciating, I mean, foreign languages. Yeah. We live in a country that even if you speak Chi. And uh, may, maybe mistakenly uh, you miss your words. Mm -hmm. People don't find any issue with it. We are cool with it when people speak. I uh, mean, their local dialect and they have issues. And more or less, they are not flowing even well. But let people or the same person speak English and more or less have an issue, mistake like grammatical error somewhere. Mm -hmm. We'll be we'll be laughing at that person. Yama Adena Koya to say, "Brofo is everything in this country." So one table of fumpa chasa. We do not answer. Yeah. And there's a crum high, you know. Oh, table of four, ha. It means, yeah, you take a decision, sir. Go on, can And that is very bad. If you have to do it like that, then all the times, you know, you better hear the. You have to find for the. At the end of the day, you know, majority of the people in this country too can speak the local dialect more, more, more than even the what the, the foreign languages mm -hmm. that you consider. Yeah. Now let's place in PG and other stuff that uh, uh, some of our musicians use. Mm -hmm. If we have to consider this grammatical error or more or less bring our lenses to this kind of uh, I mean uh, grammar people make it seem say you have to always be right uh, then there's no need for a musician to use even pigeon okay. because formally it's not a language like formally mm -hmm. it's not accepted like um, going to that corporate level you can't use PG for setting yeah. uh, uh, meetings yeah. setting I mean uh, I mean gatherings yeah. but when it comes to the mu uh, musical line or maybe artistic I mean, uh, I mean taste or preference it fits within it 
So I had to say, Kwame na does an answer some questions now. Obi Sampone he has answered it. At some point he was like, was it artistic license? Of course. Mm -hmm. So you've already answered the question that the people want mm -hmm. are asking. And the other one too, um, he was like, um, doesn't uh, it doesn't even chop uh, or will it help us to even chop or may maybe bring food on our table? Mm -hmm. At the end of the day, the, I think the most important aspect of it is that there have to be certain things in a music composition yeah. that will always create the talkability about it. Mm -hmm. We've seen a lot of people release uh, I mean, songs in this country that a day or two the song dies off. Mm -hmm. But if at least you have two or three lines in a song, that will always bring the conversation. I think it will go a long way to more or less project, I mean, push the mileage per which the song will get. Mm -hmm. For instance, maybe I've not even listened to the song, or I've not even heard the song. With this whole conversation, will more or less ginger me to go find out or search that song and even listen to. Yeah. And maybe I, will, I might even stand the chance to even love the song more. Mm -hmm. But let's forget about everything. The song is nice. When mm -hmm. it comes to the rhyming, with the line I should in case people are finding issue with. Mm -hmm. Or they rhyming, or they, or they picking a rhyming, I mean scheme, you know, and far. And far. Mm -hmm. The A, B, or C, D mm -hmm. that is looking for Onya Wum. And the lines need you also pick it. And the arrangement and the composition of the song to what suit everything. So personally, I don't have any sh issue with it. Just ask me, can you know, Kwame Nadaze has already answered the question. Kwame and Kwame uh, okay, Kwame Daze, sorry, Kwame Daze has already answered the question. And no matter what, you will still get people who always mm -hmm. get this agenda because mm -hmm. you have people who always want to make mockery of everything that happened. Yeah. So you should just take it as part of the game. And it is show base. Mm -hmm. That is one thing that mostly we forget. It is show base, the show and the business. Mm -hmm. So these things that we are seeing add up to the show, and at the end of the day, will bring the business that we are also looking up to. So it is normal. Okay, it is normal. That is Kobe Joe's van. He said he is now. Let's move to Roland Amate Ono Mfaye Nkubu on this very first topic. Then we move to the next one, bra. Larry, um, if if some people do not understand some of these things, well, it's to me it's understandable especially if so far as you if you raise concerns like this and it, it is devoid of insults mm -hmm. and attacks of course me i i see it as legit concerns mm -hmm. because yes we all agree that some of these statements grammatically are errors and cannot be used especially in a formal setting or not mm -hmm. so if somebody raises concerns about some of these things then mm -hmm. clearly you would you it only reveals that the person do not understand artistic uh, how do you call it artistic operation and its licensing mm -hmm. it's as simple as that because if you are if you understand artistic operation and its licensing you 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 understand that in in building up a creative piece there are certain form of lines they are not stipulated like rules i the say okay the rule is a b c d and you can follow them or mm -hmm. you can break the rule to this side mm -hmm. no every creative person has his or her way of breaking rules mm -hmm. and the reason why sometimes they do some of these things is relatability yeah there are certain stories or certain things that they would want to portray in the creative pieces that they produce yeah and looking depending on the target audience and the people and how they would want the people to relate Mm -hmm. It will cause them to choose certain words, mm -hmm. certain phrases, certain lines that the people can resonate with. Mm -hmm. You understand? So mm -hmm. definitely for people to relate with some of the things that they say, they, we, that is why we see people even singing in pidgin. Mm -hmm. Pidgin is not an official language. There is no grammatical structure in pidgin. Yeah. Yeah. There is no grammatical structure in pidgin. Mm -hmm. The English that has a gra the English language that has a grammatical structure is the same structure here in Ghana, the mm. same structure here in everywhere that English is being spoken or studied. Yeah. But the pidgin we speak here in Ghana is different from the pidgin that is being spoken in Nigeria. Yeah. Sure. Yeah. So there is no grammatical structure. So if somebody uses even pidgin phrases and words in their song, it is an error. Mm -hmm. In a formal setting, you can't write pidgin. You understand yeah. even though recently because of technological advancement yes some people have been able to inculcate uh pigeon into some of our language mm -hmm. uh, stuff on on the internet yes but does it make it formal no you can't use it in a formal sentence that is plain and simple mm -hmm. so if if 
Shutter would want to use some of these phrases, then people should understand that yes, these are the creative licenses that some of these creatives have. Mm. It is part of how they operate. Mm. So that is why a, um, a musician can be singing in English. Mm -hmm. Then we'll go and bring some pidgin term. The I people will speak, uh, will, will give you a very good phrase. I'm on available. Mm -hmm. Then he will bring a pidgin phrase. Them know they see me. Them know they see me is an error. I see. Yes. If you bring it into a proper English grammatical structure, it's an error. Yet, in creative licensing sp space, it is allowed. Mm -hmm. Because the target, the people that he is targeting can relate. That is what they say. When he says that, they understand it more. Mm. And in building a creative piece, you don't only look at one thing. As much as you, 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 you want to communicate something, you also look at the strength of the people that you want to feed mm. before you send some of these things to them. So yes, as creative people, see there, there is even when you go into painting, there is the abstract painting. Mm -hmm. Somebody can just wake up, depending on the feelings that they have, they will just pick a paint, mm -hmm. they will pick a canvas, pick a brush and be painting on the canvas left right center different colors boom 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 mm -hmm. without any proper image oh, as in a human being or an object oh, yeah they will not draw any proper image but you see those scribes that they've made on the canvas mm -hmm. they will they can tell you and when they put it even onto auction they can sell it for millions yeah because it depicts the feelings that and those things anybody who cannot relate to that will call it nonsense mm -hmm anybody who mm. cannot relate to that who call it nonsense so me i am not surprised that some people are raising such concerns mm. we can only educate them on some of the operations in the creative arts space yeah. that okay the people that create some of these things for you these are some of the advantages and disadvantages that mm. they have you that you you find yourself in a formal setting unfortunately in your delivery to communicate you mm. can't put out some of these things yeah I am just imagining a bank trying to put put put, uh, put out a press release. Mm -hmm. Then crank 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 crank. Or you writing an essay or maybe an application letter. Mm -hmm. Then you go and put you go and put pigeon language in there. It's yeah. <laughs> so even, even, even with short hands. Every, everybody will see you as on serious. Yeah. Everybody will see you as on serious. Yes. Yeah, so we we it is up to us to educate some of our people and Kwame does this post as is like a two in one mm -hmm. he raised the concerns of people who probably may be ignorant about some of these things mm -hmm. and also as a learned person in the space came to answer gave them the formal response and in the latter he gave them the normal street response yeah you know be english we go chop Sup. Sup. it is about how it is about the thing i'm giving you mm -hmm. and whether if you like it you patronize it Sup. that's all okay all right so that is roland amate for you and uh chamo same way call me joseph and damian diaz and this is where we invite you to also um bring on board your knowledge about this very first topic we are here to inform you educate and of course entertain you we accept your information we accept your education same way your entertainment so let's do more at the comment section over there now we want to move on to the next topic where there is a post seven on the social media by one person's name i think he's a sack native never sack yes never sack and he did this post and uh, i felt this post is worth discussing and then he's saying sack audio shatawali and stone boy are still relevant not because of their talent alone they have empowered a number <laughs> of their loyal fans these fans have a huge social media followers and are really doing the hard, I mean, the Lord's work for them. So no matter the energy and the time invested in agenda by gatekeepers to block or retard them, it will never, never, never work. And I repeat it. Sakodie, Shatawale, and Stoneboy are still relevant, not because of their talent alone. They have empowered a number of their loyal fans. These fans are um, these fans have huge social media followers and real and are really sorry doing the Lord's work for them. So no matter the energy and time 
uh, invested in agenda by gatekeepers to block or retard them, it will never work. Chamo. Yeah, Berma. I see to it, uh, it's worth discussing. Well, but uh, the thing is, yeah, yeah, why not? We can talk about it, mm -hmm. right? Me, my issue with some of these things is that uh, you are just highlighting something that that will not even happen. I mean, if you are even thinking about it, you are just a loser. Mm -hmm. You can't block anybody in 21st century. Mm -hmm. The only way out, if indeed you want to block somebody, is to block all the digital platforms that, that the person may not have access to. Okay, then. <laughs> if you can't do that, you can't block anybody. Yeah. So at this point, I, I think even saying it is is like the uh, what we say uh -huh. in our local language. Why some why also Bruniba won't have it yeah. when you you talk too much. You you say that uh, a white man's child has a lot of uh -huh. uh, clues. Meanwhile, it's their machine that uh, make the clues. Yeah. Yeah. So there's there's no need to labor the point that. People can't block anybody to shine yeah. in 21st century, especially yeah. if they have made it already. Like you can do that to an up-and-coming artist or an artist who is not that mm. big. I mm. mean, that one you can easily do something like that because they will not have the resources to get themselves out there in other platforms. <laughs> but when you 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 grow to certain extent that that thing is 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 way 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 below you uh -huh. nobody can block you in any way possible uh -huh. even and and again the gatekeeper uh, tag i think we should stop uh, giving it to people because at this point the, the gates are so much i mean to de describe somebody as a gatekeeper is somebody who can <laughs> Uh, decide to put you on a platform or not. Uh -huh. But uh, long time ago, you can only get access to, let's say, GBC okay. in Ghana here. Or uh, you go and see an executive producer who will listen to your song no, and go. then it will be like, okay, this is good. This is a good song. Uh -huh. I will produce it for you. Then they will give you money. Go out there, make copies of uh, 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 your song like the cds cassette or whatever at that time it was perfect to describe some people as gatekeepers uh -huh. because if they don't give out their money you can't publish yourself uh -huh. if they don't influence people for you to be on tv you can't do anything uh -huh. and uh, so at that point we had gatekeepers yeah but now to publish yourself, you don't need only TV stage. You may not even need it at all. Mm -hmm. Radio stations, the same thing. It's, it's another avenue for you to put yourself out there. But mm -hmm. you don't necessarily need them. What, what do you need now? You need your social media platform. You need Facebook. You need uh, TikTok. You need Instagram. You need YouTube. I love, I love that. That's have, what you have, need. We have an, another topic that we need to discuss. That, what that's what you need in this uh, uh, 2023. Mm. That's what you, in, in fact, that's what you need. Mm. If you decide to go only on TV and radio, you will not get anywhere. Because the numbers there are way, way, way below what you, the access that you, uh, the number of people that you have access to when you are online. Okay. So we don't have gatekeepers as it used to be anymore. Mm. Even if they are there, People will pass other way that they will not need any gates to pass through because that place is way, way open for anybody to enter. Now it's more about gathering more resources, connecting with more people, letting people get the feel of what you want to bring out, and then you are in. That's it. That's so, so for him to even talk about gatekeepers and they can't block anybody's mm. shine, it, for me, it's like he's talking too much because at this point, even if you are thinking in that direction, it, it will not go anywhere. Okay. Like Shatawali will, let's say, uh, have issue with Andy Dusty, Kwesi mm. uh, and uh, some other people like the big guns in the mm -hmm. in the game, like mm -hmm. big people in the game. But the point is, Shatawali can decide not to go there, mm -hmm. and still people will hear of him. 
Okay, Richie, but for I need to be my wife. Post it now. So, who is the gatekeeper here? Because mm. I want you uh, and the dust. Okay. Now let's uh, let's let's look at, at the, this concern. Uh, mm -hmm. They have empowered. Uh, they have empowered uh, a number of their loyal fans. These fans have a huge social media followers, uh, uh, and are really doing the Lord's works for them. Mm -hmm. Would you also say that is true? Yeah, of course. I mean, that's that's the thing. I mean, social media is the age in 2023. If you don't have social media presence, you you are not relevant. Mm -hmm. They can play your song all day on a radio station. Mm -hmm. If you don't have social media presence, you are not relevant. The same way, even the radio stations, those without social media presence, they are not relevant. Mm -hmm. Even the radio stations, they need social media. They are there. They are. They even boast of the kind of numbers that they have there. Mm -hmm. So they are even fighting with the celebrity for that same space. I love that. I love that, Chimo. I love that. So, <laughs> so, so, so I think we, we shouldn't stretch, uh, stress too much on who can block who, uh, who is the gatekeeper and all that. I think in 21st century, we have so many gates that nobody can keep it and decide who should enter. I see. You can enter from all angles. Just do what is necessary and you are in the game. Yeah. Just do what is necessary and you are in the game. This is coming from Chevo. Let's move to Kobe Josephan. Bra. Yeah, this is the post. Yeah. You want to enter into it proper, proper? <coughs> yeah, sure. Okay. I think sir, me me big man, I, I can't be brave. Yeah. And the from the angle looking from um, one angle, I think sir, whatever that the guy is saying is true. Mm -hmm. Let me tell you, had it not been the fan base mm -hmm. of most of our musicians, mm -hmm. most of them and come carry away. Can you, can you name few? Oh, even Shatawali. For real? I'm telling you the gospel truth. So, Shata, you the fan base. Anka. So, oh, and yet the kind of strong fan base now to me are building. Ah, I'm to me pushing them to some level, especially when mm -hmm. this we, we, we find we find ourselves in a space that is mm -hmm. blacklisting, mm -hmm. let me block this thing mm -hmm. Charlie and can coffee be brief and can most of our talented musicians can carry a group. Okay, so it has nothing to do with his craft. It is maybe the people trying to say Oh the craft I will come there. Okay sure. You see Shata or Sakodi or Stoneboy mm -hmm. have been able to accumulate this kind of fan base, mm -hmm. vibrant fan base because mm -hmm. of hard work. Yeah. We all know the genesis of these guys. They've worked hard. They've paid their dues. So everything that you see them benefiting now, it, it doesn't just come by chance. Mm. If you've seen them controlling that kind of huge numbers, mm -hmm. it's because they've worked hard and they've able to prove to the people that we have what it takes to always prove to you. Okay. So all the time, these people are more or less convinced to be following their heroes. Mm. And then and then said, most of our problems in this industry are these i shouldn't say so called these are again uh, what gatekeepers yeah the problem be brave you see i did back on my say personally matthias he said if at a point they are they are chopping from you, mm -hmm. you, you, from you. yes you pretend as if say uh, you are not seen or maybe you are okay with them mm. um, boo. No, you are mm -hmm. You are very respectful, you are calm, you are good. But the very moment when you babe say so or no, at this point, at the way a year media and person general, that is when they tend to be like, Oh, um what you say, what you say, a cry where they say, then they start to what have a second plan about you. Yeah. But with social media, just as my big man said, nobody can blacklist anybody, mm -hmm. especially when you're a huge figure like Shatter Stoneboy and Sam. Mm -hmm. What can you do to block these people? Let's take this uh, traditional media out. If they decide not, if they can even decide, so we won't go to this traditional media mm -hmm. to also uh, to, uh, go there promote our song. With TikTok and other handles, they can do the magic. Mm -hmm. If I have my numbers and they'll be streaming my song, at the end of the day, royalties, this and you may be a high bomb, you may need my own. So even if you don't play any song, but now bomb, and so that benefit, it be a sad say Odin days. Yeah. Because at the end of the day, it's Boomplay and what Spotify and mm -hmm. other digital platforms are doing the magic, bringing him the money. Why do he has to even bother about this whole thing? What do they make an answer? But whatever that we see, you know, until we work our things right and make things happen, this is how always the conversation will be. And not long ago, Adam set an example when uh, or can say uh, some 
a, a set of gatekeepers plan to more or less mafia mm -hmm. one artist. I know the, the, the story is known out there. And with this DJ thing, foreign event planners come all the time mm -hmm. with all the budget that they give. We hear that most of DJs are being budgeted $5,000. Okay. What to say, Krum Hayat, to DJ B, $5,000. DJ B. Me, me, sir. So what to say, Krum Hayat, to DJ B, $5,000. That's a problem. But at the end of the day, their company, you know, it is the same gatekeepers. That they think they are doing good for the industry, but they are more or less causing more problem than the good that we see. So all these things that we see, problem ni na no, the gatekeepers no. Gate na kasi ang padros and just as same as same. Si si obia so ya. Utu mi nyan numbers kakre bi na jana na ose mi gatekeeper. Utu mi mo bi one two link bi a ose mi gatekeeper. So I think um, the guy ni kano it is true that uh, uh, it is. Um, these people, the numbers that they have there that are doing the magic for them, and I have one mama, my what me to me a sustainable industry. Mm. We shouldn't also uh, forget uh, hard work and then their consistency and how they've been the experience in the game too has also helped them to more or less be, 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 be more or less be relevant in the space. Mm. So, without, uh, without the controversy or other talkabilities that we talk about, we still mm. need to be working hard to always. Have something to share out there to prove to the people. Mm -hmm. And Tessa, you you might get a hit. You might be in the news, I mean, for some month, but a baby baby now was answering because you didn't work hard to get what um what is uh, expected for you to, to get in the so space. Yeah. Does that mean Patapa is not working hard? Oh, yeah, so working hard, they depend it will be a the way they depend on working hard. Patapa part to pass just me cancer, but my part is a working hard no, it will be how we define the working hard. Obi be feeling say me working from an hour five to four while working hard. We be since we feeling say say the one hour and put me, or put in any man right to achieve whatever result that you want to achieve. And that is also hard work. But it's about the hard work. Yes, and the hard work that I'm talking about, it all come to play the kind of people that you have around you mm -hmm. that will more or less you can more or less decentralize some of your activities to them. I mean, share responsibility to them. Yeah, and so both me focus on other angle. Mm -hmm. But if you don't work your things out now, people might seem say you are you are not working hard. But if you are closed doors now, you are doing your best to bring the best I mean project to the people there. Yeah. Okay. So as a stanza, what's your part? He's working hard. Okay. <coughs> Pata Pizzi, part to pass soldiers. We are still with you, Roland. Barry. This is the post from Nebasak. Uh, well, I think he he has a point because mm -hmm. he is speaking in the moment. Yeah. For, for whatever it is, well, I think it, it will be absurd, especially in, in a point where there are so many avenues to mm -hmm. to get your stuff out there. Yes, some people may, like, the platforms may differ from the other, mm -hmm. yes, and because of that, some people may want to use that as a leverage. Yeah. However, it still doesn't um, point to the fact that there are so many avenues. Mm -hmm. In fact, the avenues in selling your product as a creative now is so many than before mm -hmm. due to technological advancements. And be out of that, and also even um, if we even should take out technology, in terms of appeal and how brands relate with their customers or their end mm -hmm. users, mm -hmm. there are so many strategies that come with it. Mm -hmm. See, there are some beaters. Uh, okay. alcoholic beverages let me put it that way that are not popular in our faces so. mm -hmm. but when you go into the hinterlands i tell you they're making waves the way they are selling the beat is the only mobile the way they are selling mm -hmm. see that you are talking oh i'll be caring since my friend so he gives me updates okay all right no problem like the way they are selling mm -hmm. <laughs> you you get it no you see it's, it's something that i'm trying to say the point is that there are some people that f are able to find a way mm -hmm. to connect with people when you see companies doing csr companies so uh, corporate social responsibility yeah. it is not just for a fluke or the the motive is not all about helping people mm -hmm. but also your brand brand is not only about how people look like how people see you dress mm -hmm. but it is the perception that people have about you yeah so if people have the perception the perception that people have about you if it is such that oh chemo is a good person oh chemo is kind-hearted chemo is this chemo is that you see those people 
they can easily patronize whatever Chemo would bring than any other person. Okay. Regardless of the quality. The fact that they know, oh, Chemo is kind-hearted. When we patronize Chemo and Chemo gets money, he can come and build a KVIP with modern soup and with modern soup we wash our hands. How do we patronize him? It's, it's like that. Maybe the brands may be doing it to help the community, but indirectly, these are some of the results that you get back. Yeah. And when you check the artists that they've mentioned, Sarah Cordier's wife has a foundation. Mm -hmm. Stoneboy's wife has a foundation. Yeah. Even Stoneboy himself has a foundation. foundation. Shatter is a working father Christmas. Mm -hmm. You understand? I didn't mention the wife. Oh, say, yeah, oh, he's not he married. Has no he wife, has no wife. He's not married yet, so he has no wife. You understand? So he he is literally a working for that Christmas. You understand? So some of these things are things that are the people are able to connect with. Mm -hmm. There are some people who like Shatawali simply because of whenever he goes at the money that he throws. They like him because of that. And yes, he can yet one more for than pool. They've never gotten some of the money yet. That particular gesture, mm -hmm. just imagining that oh, at least somebody has gotten some. It's okay for them to patronize those people. And you see, l this is off internet or off technology. Mm. These people in question have been able to build it so much that it will be difficult for you to take it away from them yeah. at once. Mm -hmm. Say, and, or cut them off from it. Because the people that are patronizing, that are linked to them, they did not link to them because of you. Okay. They can you can only cut them off if you hold that link or if you hold that power of link. You understand? Even yeah. that oneself, it will be a little difficult, especially if the people's understanding has gotten or have gotten to a different level. Mm. Mm. So since there are one more avenues, even online or on the waves, in terms of breaking out or reaching the masses, mm -hmm. now people that are labeled as gatekeepers do not hold an ultimate power mm -hmm. even to the extent of blocking people mm -hmm. or sabotage yes they they can try to sabotage you in certain ways deny you certain opportunities mm -hmm. but then if you are able to break through those genes and your your issues are or your your products are able to reach the masses yeah. there's nothing they can do about it so it's it's like that i mean maybe when we move to the next topic we can elaborate more but then there there are some people how many times have you seen asaka a go for interviews there's a cowboy how many how many times have you seen them go for interviews how many times have you seen that lumba go for interviews <laughs> yet if that is lumba that lumba the last one that lumba had mm. there was an overflow at the gate if we are talking about one of the most relevant artists in Ghana currently, mm -hmm. currently, he's one of them. Mm -hmm. How many times do you see him go for interviews? You understand? So, if if you want to say, okay, because that Lumba has blocked you, you think you're a gatekeeper and you want, uh, like, has wronged you, and you think you're a gatekeeper and you want him, to, you want to cut him off. Mm -hmm. eh? You, you, soft, eh? it's like fighting the wind. Mm -hmm. It's like fighting the wind. If you don't take it, you might end up hurting yourself. So, yeah, what the boy is saying there, well, on a surface level, it, it is not up for debate. It's, mm. it's not something that, even if you want to think about it, you are worrying yourself. Mm. Okay, 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 all right. Thank you very much, Roland Amate, on this very one too. And uh, we want to sway, or we want to just flip to the next uh, page. And uh, our next topic, this is coming from Bright Jumbo. And he happens to be the CEO of Ghana Songs, the music platform. And it's inside or in connection with the very first, I mean, the very second topic that we discussed here about gatekeepers and social media. And Shemot made one funny thing, one comment, and still it's been ringing in my head that this traditional media people that you want us to take our songs to them, our 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 creativity or craft to them mm. or our act to them to help us they are also chasing this same tiktok mm. uh facebook instagram or whatever it Me is too. for relevance mm. now this man 
is saying that TikTok is part of, you know, um, the the collapsing of Ghana music. And there is a story cited on Ghana Web saying that TikTok collapsed in Ghana music industry. Ghana Songs CEO said that thing. Okay. The chief executive officer, CEO of the uh, music platform Ghana Songs, Bright Jumu, has asserted that TikTok is collapsing the music industry. In his view, the social media platform says the um, evolution has rapidly risen uh, to become one of the most popular tools worldwide. With its short-form videos and viral challenges, TikTok has gained immense popularity among young users, significantly impacting various industries. As a result, Ghanaian artists no longer promote their songs through traditional media. According to Mr. Jomo, any artist who releases a song channels most of his or her promotion through TikTok, which is just an avenue to hype the song. This medium, um, this medium, he bemoaned doesn't last as compared to the traditional media like the radio where the DJ will play it on rotation to make listeners have a feel of the song and make it last longer in the system. Any artist that releases a song always has TikTok promotion in mind, but TikTok only hypes uh, the song for a week to a month and it fades away. But if they follow the normal procedures by involving the traditional media, by touring the radio and the TV stations, it is 70% assured that it will blow and help it last longer in the system than using TikTok, he asserted. I mean, he stated. Now, Chabu, what am I reading here? What's Mr. But it's like he's saying opposite of the reality. What is it? What is it? Oh, yeah, I can't quit you. Oh, and I never tell you. Oh, yeah, I can't quit you. Oh, read this story. I don't know. I don't know. So, uh, so his company, what, what, what do they do? Oh, they, they, they promote, promote songs. yes. They upload songs. Yes, it's a, I said like they promote songs. Okay, on yeah, on social media <laughs> or on okay. Okay. website or website. T T T T. What? And now, no, like how, like no, I don't get it. You can't think far. You know, I can't think far. You can't think madness. No, not at all. I can't think far. If that's his job and he's talking like that i think he's saying opposite of what <clears throat> is happening currently oh yes when when you take your song to uh, a traditional uh, media platform mm -hmm. like radio or tv mm -hmm. they will play it once a call that's the end of it yeah, but that's not the case in, in in social media it will be there forever so it's opposite of what he's saying. Or oh, maybe if you do, um, you know, a follow up and uh, uh -huh. you do a little pay, 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 do uh -huh. play, 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 uh -huh. for it to sing in people's head. That's okay. what he's saying. And that thing is still on social media. Anytime that you want access, you have it. Not all has access to social media. Yeah, but that's the means now. The people, the audience that you want to appeal to, that's where they are. So although you think people have money to pay the radio and TV station to play it, play, 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 like you are saying it. You imagine how much will you pay for a traditional medium like uh, like UTV? Play your song for one year, like on rotation, and at the time that you think people will be watching, mm -hmm. as compared to putting it on uh, social media, and then any time that the person wants to hear your song, they will can just take their phone, pa, then they are listening to it. Which one do you think is the best? And it means you'll be like. Um, so follow me on um, Facebook. You uh -huh. that song will be playing. playing on Facebook all the time, and you say I should go and pay the <laughs> TV station to play that song on Facebook. On Facebook, <laughs> come on. He's just saying opposite of what is happening right Maybe now. Maybe he's losing his job. Oh, yeah. of course. If he he will not change his ways or even his thinking. I think he will lose, and this this will not be the first time. Me, even a big shot lost their job because yeah. they didn't follow technology. And a very good example is Nokia. Nokia, Nokia's uh, chief executive officer, the CEO of Nokia, in 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 his speech said that we didn't do anything wrong, but we have lost. 
<laughs> because at the time Nokia was known for their batteries, mm -hmm. and then they concentrate on giving people ba batteries. good battery. <laughs> so when people were developing software that people are happy about, <laughs> yeah, they were batteries. talking about batteries. <laughs> Our phones have good batteries. Our phones have good batteries. Before they realize, people don't care about the battery. We will go with our charger. When it goes down, we will charge it. We have power banks. Yes, we have power banks. We don't care about the battery. So you have not done anything wrong. But people don't like it anymore. So you will lose. And I think the same thing will happen to this man if he doesn't change his oh, mind. It's, it's happening to him. You wait, I'll explain. It yes, before. then uh, because he didn't change his mind. Technology is moving to the next level. Uh -huh. Now you have to find a way to fit in. Get the people that you think you can work with. Do the things that will help you. And then you move to the next level. Yeah. If you don't go that way and you think that, no, they are spoiling our thing. You think uh, TikTok will go? No. TikTok will be there. So for him to say that if you do promotion on TikTok, uh, it then it, it will last within a week. No, a week he, he doesn't know how the social media works because it will last forever. In fact, until TikTok will be no more as a company, mm -hmm. that video will be there for the rest of it, mm -hmm. like for the rest of your life. Any time that you want it, or the let let anything comes to your head, take your phone, mm -hmm. go on any social media platform type for it and see whether you not get it or not. Mm -hmm. By the same way, let's switch our TV to UTV and see whether they will be playing your song. I see. Uh, mm -hmm. But your song is still on social media. Mm -hmm. You can go and play it anytime. When people call you that, Charlie, I want to listen to your song, you tell them, go on Facebook, go on Boomplay, go on Spotify. Mm -hmm. It's there forever. Not uh, on, your, uh, on, on, on our TV stations or on our radio station. So they are losing it. In fact, the prediction coming is that even the radio stations and the TV station will not be any relevant as they are now. Now mm -hmm. that they, they are even, they validate whatever that you do. It's like when you are sensational on social media and then we find you on TV, okay, then the guy has arrived. Yeah. Now that's what the traditional medium or the traditional media that's what they are doing. Mm. If you get there, it's, it means you are legit now. You are no more mm. a social media sensation, keke. You mm. are legit. But because they will lose their relevance, it will get to a point that even if you are on TV, it's rather that it's because you can't find yourself on social media to be relevant. That's mm. why you'll be on TV. Mm. Because it will be easy to get on TV than to be recognized on social media. It's, yeah. You know, it's easy to get on social media, but it is not easy to be recognized on social media. Okay. You can create an account today, put whatever you want to put there. Mm -hmm. One week time, over corner zero views. <laughs> and people are competing on, in, in that space. Everyone, everybody wants to be relevant on social media. And mm -hmm. there are so much that only few people are making it on social media. Yeah. But that's where we are now. That's where the competition is. Mm. It's so easy to be on TV at this point. Because if you have your money, if you have uh, some simple, simple thing, mm. you can just find yourself on TV. But guess what? You can easily get on social media, but nobody will notice you for about a year. Now, be a crowd and say, oh, Oh, because oh, oh, when there anything relevant for people to get to mm. you, the mm. point is a lot of people are there. So we are looking at them. Now, if you want to be relevant, you are going to compete with somebody like Shatawali, mm -hmm. Sarkodie, mm -hmm. Samini. Uh, mm. Talk of all the big, big artists. Mm. Not only them, David Ho, Benna mm. Boy. Mm. You are competing with C. Ronaldo. You are competing with mm. Messi. Messi. So imagine how do you become relevant in this yeah, space? It. So it's so difficult, but easy to get there, mm. easy to find yourself on social media, but difficult to be recognized mm. as compared to the traditional, traditional media. media. So you be relevant uh, on our traditional media is losing its value gradually. So it's better you find a way to be part of what is happening now. Mm. I can bet you. 
Sami Flex TV now is relevant than, I mean, more than half of the TV stations that we have here. Oh, no, no twist about that. Yes. So, so even if we take that as a yastic, oh, what are we talking about here? So, the, the guy, he, he is rather not focusing and he will lose like Nokia. <laughs> So you see, why Chamo says that um, it's easy for you to find yourself on social media, but it's not easy for you to be relevant. Yeah. I know some people will come with argument and say, hey, now say recently everybody can blow on social media anytime. Yeah. You see <laughs> what they are doing? That is making them sensations. Mm. It's not easy. If it is easy, do some and blow tomorrow, let's see. If it is easy, if you think, oh, somebody is just that mm. and has mm. gone viral, or somebody has just done Cobra, uh, how they have been to? and has, has mm. just, oh, she killed the two and they are not viral, grab it, she killed the two and cast away a double double. I can't grab a double double. Grab it, she killed the two like the point I'm no, making is, can't, 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 so hard on you that <laughs> you will see you, that you it's not easy. easy. You will see. You may not even find it easy to do. But yeah. Yeah. that was just by the way. Let me <laughs> come to this part. Yeah. God has something that's come. You see, some of the musicians in this country, they are crying and being poor, eh? It's because of some of this man and his colleagues. Why? <laughs> yes. It's because of this man and his colleagues. <laughs> <laughs> you see them? God has come that corner. God has the days. <laughs> <laughs> the days are the corner. No, they are the corner on the website. Okay. You see the website? They create a download button. So whatever downloads that will come, Whatever thing that will come, it is his business. Mm. And he said, "Yeah, wow, it's them. They are supporting them. The, the, <laughs> <laughs> the oppression is just like you see on the other side. We have some guys who have songs on their laptop. Mm. You pick them, right? Oh, they send. They, they, they will copy it for you. Then they take money. It's mm -hmm. just like that. Mm -hmm. So the digital form of that business. That business. Mm. Yes. Mm. So the he is complaining because Sikamba. now Sikamba money is not. Zach Nations dot com. See, see, I need to. No, but Zach, they may. No, you see, no. Let me tell you, it is still in operation, mm -hmm. but mm -hmm. the, mm -hmm. you see that operation, mm -hmm. it is ill, uh, it is illegal. Mm -hmm. It is illegal. Oh yes, it is. Why is it illegal? You see, the downloads that you are having. If that download had come to me, my page as a musician, uh -huh. would have been mm, money, money to me. To me. Uh -huh. mm. When it comes to your page, uh -huh. regardless of the number that has come to your page, uh -huh. I receive zero from it. Really? Yes. Yeah. Oh, so what are, 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 I mean, our musicians do? Exactly. They are supporting them. <laughs> no, I want to understand. Uh -huh. you know, say it is illegal uh -huh. that Zach Nation uh -huh. uh, Ghana motion, Ghana motion, motion uh, uh, Ghana uh, Ghana 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 Ghana. Ghana. Ah, so what are our artists waiting for? Exactly. They are supporting them, they are promoting them. Exactly. That's where that's the from. argument that they do. Uh -huh. Be so so you see you know you let me tell you ah let me give ah, let me give me no let me give me a sense that maybe they have they have um, maybe shares no, in the same year fifty fifty and now 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 the things are changing let me tell you the reason why this man is complaining you see first Nanka Ghana songs me I am an artist mm. because he has traction on his website and that is that was the norm no. yeah. If I am going to him for him to put my song on his I website, pay. I will pay. That is if I, I am not popular. But mm -hmm. if I am popular, now mm -hmm. I have leverage to strike with him. So yeah, download it now. Nya say ya, me nya say now. Even that one crown, or ten a day. No wama me ne wama me dey. In tina, he would go and put his jingle on my song. Mm -hmm. You understand? Mm -hmm. That is why he will go and put his jingle on my song. But now. The operation has changed. The same Ghana songs, me as an artist. Now, when I go, because ah, if I should put my songs on my page, and there's an example, let's say one stream is one CD. Mm -hmm. 
and 10 people are supposed to stream my song. If 10 people have streamed it on my it would have been 10 cities. Now, if those 10 people, if I it is on Ghana songs, and out of those 10 people, 4 goes to stream from him, and 6 come to streams from me, do you know what it means? I get 6 CDs, he gets 4 CDs, and I get nothing. Instead of 10 CDs, that's the move. Operation. I see. Until no, most of the numbers, the reason why sometimes the streaming culture is late here is because of this. You see somebody like Fancy Gadam. When he goes, when he stages a show right now, you see thousands of people showing up. But when he releases a song, you see those people, not even half of them understand the streaming to go and stream. Not even half of them understands this. He complains every day. Because of because they have access. You see, you were telling me that is you can still download. Mm -hmm. Because they still have access to some of these websites. And all these ones, regardless of the promotions that they are giving, is piracy. Mm -hmm. It's piracy. Unless the musician you have a deal with the musician, even that oneself. Me, I would not advise any musician to, to do that deal. And then Gafako would do much. Exactly. Me supporting the Gafako would do much. Exactly. <laughs> Where you can have correct data of, of your of your work. And no no, oh oh yeah, when him say okay, way free has say, oh, this is the number of streams from Burkina Faso, this is the number of streams from this. This is so when you are working, you have data to work with. If it really help you in your promotion, why are you first one? I'm more more bolegan kwan streaming. Tomorrow, when you are working and you want to promote, you target other people elsewhere. That's how some of these things are. So these people, eh, they are come. You see, why should they are for traditional media? Mm -hmm. The issue is not traditional media. Mm -hmm. The issue is not traditional. That's why I say I ask the first question that if it is traditional media, what was it? So I say if you go for radio interviews and TV interviews mm -hmm. now as we speak. It is seventy percent assurance that you blow. Yeah. It clearly shows that you see the technological advancement in terms of music business. Mm -hmm. He's far behind. I see. Oh, he's far behind. Then he really doesn't understand. Then you see, like with his mindset, Anka Patapa oh blow that. Now radio station better be at the time now. now yes. Own blood that that is my own. Patapa. With that mindset, mm -hmm. and can be to say patapa. Own like how many how no how many top stations the patapa go before, before blowing? Blue. Me me but me. Why why why? Patapa? See even remember even when one corner became a hit, mm -hmm. even on the street on the ground, say I have radio presenters mm -hmm. who yeah. have vowed some yeah. more that. Yeah, it's true. Mm -hmm. Exactly. It's true. But yes, patapa um, blow yeah. Blue yes, Pastor Pat not bigger than so many of our artists. Blue exactly. Blue blue, blue the money that Pastor Pat has had in or has in music mm -hmm. is more than somebody's your friend is saying career or the T radio, so even as a media person. Yeah. I tell you. The money that Pastor Pat will charge for an appearance mm -hmm. is, is about a radio presenter's a whole mm -hmm. annual mm -hmm. salary. Like now. It's no joke. Like now. <laughs> 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 you be like now. Oh yes. Yeah, no, sure. Oh yes. Oh, Patapa will not take anything less than twenty k. Patapa. How do you see Patapa? Patapa has more than five heads. Don't joke with it. No, I know. Exactly. But that, it's just that I I barely see him or hear him. Who? Yeah. Yeah, then you don't follow him. Uh, Patapa. No, 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 no. Patapa. Has, I can tell you, if we are looking at one of them, the people who have performed. So many in this country. Who you fight for? Patapa will be one of them. Hey, oh, yeah. go on. No, this is not as for the This is not as for the No, you see all the shows that he goes to perform. Eh? He, he, he usually does after on his socials. Yes. And, see, mm. in a month, you can see Patapa, especially if it is festivals. Mm. Those festivals, mm. those during those occasions, you can see Patapa mm. 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 during during those occasions. Oh, the ones that when the show went to play Takra, they came to play Cape Kosoba as we do. Patapa played four. When the show played three, Patapa bought four. It's me, Stoneboy. Yes. Sarkodie. Yes. Shata. Yes. Black Sheriff. Black Sheriff. Black, Black Sheriff. Yes. Never Patapa count. Now when the show. 
well, for me, when they say, you see, there are some shows that when they say wouldn't take that show, Pata Pabaji. <laughs> if this is the analysis, part two, part soldiers. No, he will, you see, me. it is it is about ratings and service. Mm. It is about ratings and service. There are some shows when you say would reject. You see that show, Patapa will play. And that is what has made him play more shows this year. Me, I have followed him. Uh, see, people who are performing this year, I'm following them. I'm following them because in December, most of them will come and do number. So if you are not able to accumulate some of this money to help you sustain you for the year, December, more, it is just few people who have correct who are able to take correct money in December. It is just few people, especially the musicians who most of them are all supporting artists, supporting artists. Oh, let me go and pass through for them. That's how it is. So with this man, eh, now he will start crying. Because now musicians name when you are say or the new cotogana songs.com. It is better for him to find and even is it reverb there's reverb and others reverb. Even for them they have option for you to sell them exactly yeah it is mm. better for you to even go go and put your music on reverb than even put it on some of these websites me my website, website if if i want okay. to upload even if i want to do a story for you mm. and upload your song i put your uh, down your your dsp links mm. there yeah that is the right thing for you to do mm not to put the person's raw audio mm. on the website for people to have access with it no that's download that's okay. streaming is still part of the person's patronage mm. unless the person wants to give the songs away for free that one is different because we know musicians who would want to just put it on their socials for people mm. to download them for free that one is different let the musician decide but don't do it for him that is theft. It's a support. Okay. It's support them. You want to play a hit song? One corner there. Chance in Taflimo. Chance in Taflimo. Oh baby, oh baby. That's a song we have to go on. Yeah, I like that song too. Yeah. Oh, a lot of them, and even Akwaba. It wasn't his song. Wait, 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 Pat. Yes. By he he was part of it. Yes. Welcome, yeah. Yeah, Akwaba. Yes. I see. Okay. <laughs> you know, let me let me just make this thing. No, but you know from from Kaswa. No, but from let, Kaswa let, to Winnipeg. Uh -huh. From Kaswa to Winnipeg. Uh -huh. Patapa is one of the hottest artists there. No, let me let me make this thing. Anytime I mention Patapa's name, mm. it's not like I'm undermining him or his works or anything. Then you are doing what? Oh, that's what you guys think. I'm not thinking in that man. No, but I'm he's also asking ask for some people who yeah. may, oh, okay. may be thinking okay. that way. Yes, I want you to, to do agenda with the whole. No, thing. I just want you to understand that there's an artist called Patapa. Still go check him out. Okay, thank Come you. Come, so Let's go. Yeah, I will start by saying, so social media is the most powerful tool now mm. for music promotion. Mm -hmm. Unless maybe you don't know how to play it, the, your cards well for it to favor you. Mm -hmm. And Sisi, I know uh, with. Ghana songs, what he's saying now. Um, the same uh, traditional media people are saying, say they want to blacklist mm. these are musicians. Mm. Another person is crying, say they should go there to promote their song. Mm -hmm. So, which of them and I ain't that's in common as. And more or less, too, with this traditional media, no, how many times would they even play your song? Mm. Sometimes they will even wait till say maybe you're coming for an interview. Now, my shall say more bond you. We can't cover that as well. Yeah. But right now, with and TikTok. Even with TikTok now, or can say it is rather, I uh, mean, um, doing what? Uh, I'm coming. A week or. Yes, uh, trying to collapse the this, uh, our yeah. uh, music industry now. I think TikTok now is one of the powerful, most powerful. I mean, tools now when it comes to yeah, but now let me add this: uh, they now even license the song. Yes, so for they you. Pay royalties for you. Uh, if somebody plays your song on TikTok, it's after the royalties. Yes, yes. They pay royalties. Yep. TikTok. Beginning. Yeah, yeah, but yeah, but yeah, but radio stations. So the radio stations don't pay royalties to Gamru. Yeah, I didn't answer. Mm. Oh, so yeah, Okay, I heard it basically. Is there a beginning and now do when you to her like you you have this kind of copyright issue, you know? Yeah. But right now, then you know to her 
eh what the audio be and a video be to on a musician behind you mama when you say number credit say this song has been added yes. to on the audience yes. so right now no much to me i i more the sad eh uh, we know i can that figure no and that i mean a kind of can uh, the musicians too can more or less mm. benefit directly from from uh, you trying to i mean promote or more or less maybe a maybe a person wants to have a fan or app no so and take to aside the music promotion and yeah. no, the other beneficiaries they will. you go there do live videos and stuff if you are uh, able to accumulate certain numbers yeah. uh, people give you a uh, gift and i mean other things yeah. you get money yeah so if i'll go to this app and get money there why don't i focus more of my attention there and get money there yeah. than go to somewhere that in quote the person might also be thinking say oh yeah me favor helping supporting me one so no not on uh, mafia at the mechanic mm-hmm. so i think say just as roland kind of those days no most of our musicians now mountain here maybe i say mm-hmm. but right now it's like the understanding the whole music business at itself they are not seeing it to be like oh let me just play a show to impress but yeah. aside the show no no let me play the show and make money from it mm-hmm. because the predecessors may be a, a mistake be, yeah. ah yeah maybe i'm going in the cc and if you're a musician and you get to your prime level and you don't work your things out oh my son i can't say and contribute to my master come back to you chroma and this country like i said chroma no a comedy war so when you have the chance to i mean cash out from some of your i mean projects mm. do your things right so that you can more or less uh, benefit from it uh with the issue no cancer blacklisting you know, i think sir uh, uh, it's not going in favor mm-hmm. and if you want to benefit or i mean get something from this new way of i mean promoting music you should learn and upgrade his standard and trust me you you also what I mean benefit from these um social media apps you know. mm-hmm. but uh, now generally say well i still have the website and i still have to focus then along the you know because my name was music website i was promoting music that was the reason why i switched from iphone to android because when you want to do the downloading and other stuff iphone doesn't support, doesn't support you can't it. do that and so mm-hmm. i have to sell my iphone then um, you have to sell your Android then. No, 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 no. I was iPhone. using an iPhone. I, I was using an iPhone 8. Now, now yes. First, no, you saw iPhone 4. I wasn't. Uh, you can't use iPhone <laughs> to, to do music. I didn't care. So I said, oh, iPhone. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> can't say my now to behind the scene now. Yeah, you are. Uh, oh, iPhone. We need to wear to iPhone. What's it? 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 Okay. Uh, iPhone. The emperor, eh? The emperor, what you are saying I was using an iPhone, but because of music promotion, mm-hmm. the uh, downloading and uploading of mm-hmm. the music on mm-hmm. this website, mm-hmm. you can't use iPhone to do. Mm-hmm. Uh, Android na uh, support is hard, yeah. so I have to give it out and more or less get a device that will support. Mm-hmm. And so in short of this, no, no, uh, Ghana song, no, onion in, in the homework here. I'm trying to iPhone. I'm not saying, if he has to sell, I, I, sell I, 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 iPhone. Onion in the homework here. Uh, and more, he can, he can, more, he can also meet with these upcoming artists, you know, mm. and have a good negotiation with them. Mm. Good planning, like get away, create a path no, you for see, your very, own self. Copy where they are, Mr. Lowe. You see, and Kenya Sema. Anka, these are the people that are supposed to establish distribution websites. Yeah. Okay. Where would Anka Grady? Because they have made so much from. Exactly. Where would Anka was up on Grady? The start. Who play? Then why? Why? The Ghana boss. These are the people that are supposed to establish. Yeah. There should be a big distro company. ZachNations.com. They should upgrade. ZachNations.com. Upgrade it, no. <laughs> yeah, my own was tunes are fake tunes are fake dot com oh, yeah. no no me me the person and i'm in fact jungle too because i consulted someone or catch him said no so be person or two more power which might give you to that angle yeah. and most of the song tunes you know i i i i, I issue a disclaimer say if you think you have issue with uh, you can just DM me. Uh, DM me. DM me. So what? I, I, I guess I, 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 I don't. I will remove it. And for the next time, what? Take, 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 take. Yeah. So that I will remove it. Now, uh, instead of when you are going to... I know they say, Ashley. When you say some distribution labels have been put, what is some uh, artists need to be in jump to her? They will write to you. They will give you a warning. Warning, but say remove it. 
if you don't remove it now you can you can even stand a chance to lose even the adsense yeah, now display yeah. was yeah. 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 so a uh, idea i think is a new way about if you want to uh, continue cashing out that uh, you should more or less learn new things and abreast himself and trust me there's so many ways to cash out on creative path for himself and he he will benefit from that angle Okay, all right. Thank you very much, Kobe. But I'm going to show you about the shows. I'm going to show you shows. Go to your social media handles now. I'm going to show you. You see it. I see. I'm going to show you a superstar. I'm going to show you a global hit. I'm going to show you a superstar. Chance. Chance. I'm going to show you a free. I'm going to show you a free. Okay. That is Rolanda Mate. What is the whole Ghana? We are top five artists on Boshua. I'm going to show you a top five artists on Boshua. Yeah, I'm going to show you a show this year. Yeah. Okay. All right. So this is what we are going to um, do. I mean, this is where we are going to end um, today's episode, and uh, it's been fantastic. It's been phenomenal. It's been amazing, especially having you um, to this very point of the moment. Thank you very much, Ken Solomon Chemo. He is a YouTuber, IT specialist. Unless brothers move, we will find out what you to say. Mm. Anointed, yes. The, the only generator expert in the country. Yeah, customizing in the name of Sam. Kobe. But all being the same, come for your quality, mm. your affordable, I mean, ultra silent generator. Your Kaswa, your branch of Kaswa, Galilea. <laughs> My wonderful, I mean, viewers and so on, Kobe Josvan, I need your support. I mean, double up well, on my social media, follow me and um, enjoy some of the good works that I'm doing. Yes. All right, so that is Kobe Josvan, K O B B Y J O S V, and on all the social media platforms, Kobe Josvan. And I go by the name MC Berima, uh, your favorite MC's MC. Let's say thank you to Lorna Namati. He happens to be the social media marketer to Shark Z and uh, reporter and blogger, same way, and to Solo in team dodo aka chemo he also happens to be one of the biggest it specialists um across the world <laughs> um, i'm online the manager whole, for some whole, flex and the yes, yes online manager yeah, for online flex, 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 flex entertainment the whole world easy, word. yeah you like that too yeah, yeah, all right so carry <laughs> the digital rasta he happens to be a doctor now of um uh, camera works and uh, Richard Flex producer, director, and nurse as well in editing and production. <laughs> and to you too for being a part of the show. God bless you. God bless me. Until then, tomorrow we have another episode which is going to be beautiful. So stick and stay connected to Sammy Flex TV. We have more for you. Peace and we are out. <laughs>